Welcome back to hot and humid Orlando, Florida for the OT7 East Divisional. If you guys enjoyed our last divisionals, just wait. We have the most talented one you have ever seen today. And right now, we have one of the most anticipated debuts in OT7 history, destroying AJ Green. Coach OTB all collaborated to make a super seven on seven team and they are taking on the best team you've ever seen in Dade County, <laughs> Miami Immortals versus Pressure. It's going on right now. I'm your main man, Kieran, and I am joined here with my guy, Overtime Tom. How we doing, Tom? I'm nervous for D, man. He's got a team <laughs> finally. He's got to win. Bro, I'm unbelievably nervous for this matchup. What do you? What, what should we be looking forward to? In this Look, we're obviously talking a lot about pressure, but Miami Immortals, they haven't been doing amazing at OT7. They yeah. got a new quarterback this weekend, Darian Coleman. He's got to step up if Miami Immortals want to have a chance. But Destroying went out and did some recruiting for pressure, okay? He's got Zachariah Sample, who's been his boy. He's always talking about him on these broadcasts, and now he recruited him. He's going to be on pressure. He's going to be repping the team a little bit. Can D and uh, AJ Green and Coach OTB pull it off? Can they do this? I hope so. I hope so. I really hope so for his sake, because I'm going to cook him if not. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get down to the field. 22 minutes on the clock. Miami Immortals is starting off with the ball. The debut of Pressure 7v7 is right now. Let's go. Now, we can be a little first biased, down, right? First down. We can definitely be a little biased. I'm rooting for, I'm rooting for my guy D's team. I'm not going to lie. I will say this, though. Battle of the best uniforms you have ever seen. Right here? Pressure. I, I love it. It's literally, like, 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 like Dave was saying, it's Miami versus Orlando, it looks like. Yep. Heat colors versus the Orlando Magic, and I love those Orlando Magic throwbacks. The Penny Hardaway joints, amazing. Now, I see AJ Green on the field like he always is, trying to help out on the offensive side. Where's D at? He's got to be out there somewhere. Yeah, I see him on the sideline. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's on the sideline. He's over there yelling at. Uh, yeah, Snipe, is D like the defensive coordinator? What are we doing? I don't know if he's the defensive coordinator, man. He got he, he got the towel uh, wrapped up. You know what I'm saying? He, he just chilling, man. <laughs> he chilling. He letting, he letting the coaches do the work, man. He just getting the content. This is a big time collaboration right here. I tell you what. Now, the real question is, will it just be content or will it be actual results on the football team? Well, yeah, hey, you mentioned that. it beforehand. Uh, pressure, they got a five. lot of studs, a lot of four stars, three stars, five stars, but they might have the least amount of players on the roster. Yes, there, there's about nine players on their entire team. Ooh. Over the middle, Miami Immortals, they're going down inside the 10-yard line. So, a little bit about OT7 rules. A touchdown at the end of the drive, you will be rewarded with seven points. A defensive stop, the team is going to get rewarded with two. An interception, team gets rewarded with three. And we also have what is called the money drive. So on the money drive, if you score a touchdown, you get 10 points. If the defense gets a stop, that's four points. And if they get an interception, it is six. We also have what's called the one-point gamble. So after you score a touchdown, you have the opportunity to go for this one-point gamble. If you don't want to go for it, you're rewarded with seven points for that drive. If you get the one-point gamble, eight points. And if you you don't get it, it's six points for that drive. Go. And in the end zone, oh, they're marking him just short. Well, that's crazy. One side's marking him just short, the other side's marking him in the end zone. I think the foam pit means that it's a touchdown. Up for the question. Everybody's in the foam pit right now, though, no matter what. And that's a touchdown. Touchdown, Miami Immortals. Hey, man, Darian Coleman. They're going. back in the pit. A double jump. Oh, oh, hey, y'all hey, 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 see the story in face right now, bro. Y'all hey, see the Hey, he's sick right now. Hey, go, go talk. Go, 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 go get something from the story real quick. Ask him, ask him what's yeah, going hey, on. So, so, bro, that, that didn't look like a touchdown from our angle, bro. Short, fam. You know how to OT seven. No, I'm going to get it down. That's a little jumping out early. All right, they got the lead early, but y'all do for this. That's what pressure mean, bro. Hey, here we go. We're going to make diamonds. We're going to bust no pipes. Talk to me, bro. You got the Gatorade towel over the top. You know what I'm saying? You're on your French Montana right now, bro. It's Florida, bro. It's hot. It's my shirt. You got spots on it already, man. I got to get in the broadcast so it look like I've been playing. So. <laughs> but yeah. I, all right, y'all. You getting content, man. I'm going to let them get back to it. Back to y'all at the booth. Yeah, you already know. Pressure on offense led by quarterback Jake Merklinger. Or, yeah, Merklinger. He's a Tennessee commit going to go play with Josh Heupel. There you go. got to be a really good quarterback to go out there. We saw a quarterback that's committed to Tennessee last year at OT7. Yep. Nico Yamaliaba. I, I love when you say that name. You know it. Over the middle. Completion there. That's TJ Moore. We saw him earlier in seven uh, in uh, OT7 playing for another team. He's got 45 offers. Yep. How do you have that much mail? Yeah, I don't know how you have that many conversations. That's a lot of text messages. That's a lot of emails. That's a lot of, that's a lot of mail, as you mentioned. That's hey, I got a question for you. These players, they're playing for D and AJ. Is that a little more pressure? 100%. Like, is that kind of hard? I feel like it's kind of stressful. I, it's got to be, 100%. Over the middle. Oh! oh went for the one-handed grab. That's Gage Nix. 
from Clearwater, Florida nine. down here. That's he would have caught that, would have been incredible. I mean, because I feel like a lot of these guys probably grew up watching D, yeah. watching AJ's content, wanting to be in their one-on-ones and everything. So I'm, I'm curious to see if they'll step up and that makes them play better. I think AJ's got like a big chain that he's giving to players when they play well. I think it, he's walking around. With he's, always putting, he's always putting that uh, that DLD on something. <laughs> yeah. Erklinger One, working here on second down, two, rolling to his right. Three, looking over the middle, murky interception by Abby Immortals. Ja'Kai Rainey in pit. Oh my goodness. Man. Oh yeah, Caleb. Hey, man. Caleb, Caleb. <laughs> this is not good. LeVar is Stanford. I, I was always rooting for Miami Immortals, to be honest. Pick over across his body. First down. Ja'Kai just elevates and gets it. 10-0 hey, lead early on in this game for pressure. They are off to an amazing start. I don't know if they got this on camera because it, it, it's almost impossible, but they jump, two of their guys jump so far into the foam pit that they bang their legs against the back yeah, here. They jump too far. <laughs> you know, Miami Immortals say they play, they play Dade County football, some of the best athletes Ten in the country. Snap. I guess they're too athletic for the pit as well. Hey, man, Darion Coleman out here, new quarterback Five. for Miami Immortals. Yeah, has been here in the first couple. I kind of love it. 2026 kid. Mortal's getting off to a good start. That was an incompletion. <laughs> Second down. Up 10 0 early. Not the debut that pressure's looking for so far, but there is 16 minutes of time. There's money drives. There's all sorts of stuff that you can get to turn the tide in these football games. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, is it, you think D is regretting his decision? I don't think he's regretting <laughs> his decision. I think he needs more than nine players on the team. I'm not going to lie to you. He's. <laughs> You look over on the bench, there's like four guys over there, bro. Like, it's definitely going to need some more. But he's got some ballers. Yeah, 100%. I think they're going to start to wear over the course of this weekend, though. They're going to get a little tired. Look, it wouldn't shock me if tomorrow when we have, when we have pool play going for the playoffs, going for the finals, it would not shock me at all if he's got 10 new guys in his team that he recruited throughout the day. It wouldn't surprise me at all. No, he needs to recruit more. Speaking of recruiting, we're going to go down to the chief recruiter on Nick Saban's staff, uh, Snipe right, Jones hey, down there. I, I, got, I got AJ with me, bro. Talk to me. What's going on right now, bro? It's hot. <laughs> it's hot. My Immortals used to this. Feel me? We trying to get them warmed up. Shit, they a little sluggish right now, but we, you know, we got a lot of time. We going to see what happens. That touchdown was a little controversial, man. How you feel about that? I mean, not, you talking about the phone pin celebration for a hitch? Nah, it, it looked like they didn't even get in the end zone. I don't know. I don't know. They shouldn't even have been that close to the end zone to begin with, so I can't they talk terrible. trash. That's yeah. What, what y'all got to do to get back in the game? Say, bro, you got to get in the phone pitch. You got to do some, some coolness. Like the pick? Yeah, go to the pick. A uh, uh, one yard touch? You can't go to the pick. Oh, that's a fact. That's a fact. You got to be off the man. You got to do something stylish if you're going to hit the pick, man. Yeah, you got to do something, but what's up? Yeah, I'm not going to lie. I think you uh, hit the pit whenever you score. I think uh, <laughs> I'm going to hit the pit as many times as I want to, especially yeah, if I'm up 10 0. I'm not going to lie. Hey, hey, man, look, it's bro. 100 degrees out here. I want to make the pit a pool. Spot. He got spot. We oh, should make the fire. pit a pool. I right know. I've been, I've been talking to people. That would be but, crazy. But, but you also got to remember, they got to go back and play, bro. They can't go back and play all Yeah, you're ruining your cleats. Now you will ruin your cleats. Like, you're you're, you're ruining everything. The helmets, the cleats, yeah. everything will be all. Imagine the laundry good. you they have to do. Yeah, but, bro, it's so hot out here. They'll be drying in a second. One, yeah, that is true. Two. Got a guy rocking some Adidas cleats. Shout out to Adidas. What a dot. Right in traffic. Miami Immortals in the end zone again. Up to a 17-0 lead on pressure. It's looking ugly. I ain't gonna it is looking ugly right now. I ain't gonna lie to you. To keep it a beat, I'm gonna stay away from that side because it might it might be a little bit too. The energy might be a little too up for me, bro. It might be a lot of yelling, a lot of grabbing. I don't want no parts of that. Hey, Snipe, you wanna know what's also questionable? What's up with uh, pressure? Their offensive coordinator in a full sweatsuit. I can't do shit about that. <laughs> I have no idea. Orange sweatsuit. Hey man, first down. Pressure, man. I guess I guess that's what it's about. Maybe you know, I, need, I need to ask him about that though. He must not have to look that. at the weather. Here or something. <laughs> pressure on offense. Jake Merkinger threw a nasty Two. pick last time out. We want to see what he can do this time. We should not be outside. They just got to get I wanna, going. I, hey, They bro, really bro, do. They need it, to get something it, going. It's there. so hard to ask somebody a question when they're down 17, bro, because they have no interest. they just trying to get back from getting blown up. Yeah. Yeah, maybe they should change their focus to something else. One stop. It's still a two-possession game, though, here in OT7. Same One now. stop, and you're back in the mix. Yep. That's what they need. I'm surprised D hasn't pulled out his money drive yet, to be honest. He said no. That was simple, <laughs> Just no. Well, Coach OTB said earlier this week when we were talking to him, he's the head coach of pressure. Coach OTB, if you guys know him, what's up, fellas? What's up, Coach? 
He said earlier this week, we don't want to use the money drive unless we absolutely have to later on in the game. Or ideally, we want to use the money drive to put a team away. Now, that was a lot of confidence speaking. Yeah, I didn't expect him to say all that in the show tonight. I do want to say, however, though, Russia might have some of the best uniforms. I really like yeah. these pinstriped uh, Orlando Magic in the 90s. Second down, second down. Wow, these are tough. Yeah. They announced this team like three days ago. I don't even know how they got them made this fast. <laughs> That's kind of true, though, bro. Hey, Snipe, I see AJ and D down there, you know, filming some YouTube content. Do you think they're going to publish these videos if they get smacked? I'm going to be honest, bro. I definitely wouldn't if I was there. But <laughs> knowing these guys, man, you know what I'm saying? Two. Great guys. Great guys. Great guys. Hey, down, solid first down, down pickup there for, for pressure. Is it pressure elite? Is that what they call themselves now? Pressure elite? Maybe we just, maybe we remove the elite for a little. Yeah, just, yeah, just for a little. Yeah, you, gotta, you gotta we'll, prove it a little bit. Yeah, we'll, we'll get it back. You know, we've seen teams lose early on and then come back and win. Low pro won the first two tournaments. Their very first game, they lost. Yeah. So maybe like we'll pressure see. entertainment or something like that. Not easy. Pressure entertainment one. would be tough. I'm not gonna lie. Two, That's pretty good. Three. drops back. Looks over Ooh. the middle. That's a tackle, bro. Hey, you better not hit Penny Hardaway like that again. I swear. Hold on, hold on. They threw a fly. <laughs> they threw a fly. They, 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 it gotta be because of the tackle, right? Let me see. That's a tough hit on Gage, Nick. That's gotta be on that. Uh, we're at the 14. We're going half the distance to the seven. Hey, pressure hasn't really gotten uh, Sample involved yet. Foul. Legal contact no. And I feel like that's really their biggest the thing, right? They got to get Zachariah Sample in yeah. the next. We saw Zachariah Sample play playing for out. Mississippi Automate. Heat last time out yes. in Austin. He was a absolute Here we go. Seven yard line. It's first and, and goal. now, play. you know, destroying does his thing, only. recruits him. You know, first just like Drewski and that kid, just trying to get 20-year-old <laughs> players on his 12U football team. That's hilarious. <laughs> One. Right Finger drops back just inside the 10-yard line, so no running here. Oh, oh my goodness. Yeah, elevates, and that is a touchdown. There he is. There he is. Zachariah so Sample go finally gets Gamble in the end zone, Gamble elevates that up there. Into the pit. A very unenthusiastic ball. <laughs> 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 Get, get hey, but see how high he went to go grab that, though? That's you don't insane. Get it. You but you see, I think that they're going to... There we go. We get the replay there. Get Jackson so high, he's out of the camera view. I will tell you this, guys. It is hot out here, man. It is hot. They're going for the gamble for what? For the Smooth 90 degrees out here and very humid. Bro, you can't talk about how hot it is. It seems like they are, yeah. Bro. So for the first time today, we got a team going for the one-point gamble. Pressure is going to be going for the gamble. If they do score this, they get eight points. If they don't, they only get six for this drive. I don't get going for this round. I do get it, actually, because you get this, you get a stop, go for the money drive, put them away. Well, if you don't go for this, see, okay, so now, this is my thing, Sniper. Now you go for the money drive, you don't even have enough points to get it. Unless you, get a, unless unless you, you get, get a stop. Unless you get a stop. Oh, you're going to need to stop anyway, that so I get it. I think like that was an AJ call. But yeah, that, that, that was it didn't make sense to me. You didn't need to do that. Yeah, yeah. Hey, look, yeah, yeah. D. Schilling has broadcasted about 30 of these games. Knows all the rules and everything. Yeah. Well, that is true. If they if they, if they they score right there, they get a stop, then score again. They don't have to have a money drive right there. Right. That makes sense. But you have to go. go for it again. First down. Yeah. First down. Why would I do that? Let me, just, let me just score once and then go for the money drive. I, I don't get it. Well, they desperately need a stop here. They desperately One, do need a stop here. Miami Immortals two. moving back down here. Freshman quarterback. We do have a flag on the play. I believe it was. False start on the offense. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a false start on the Lost offense. Down. Second down. Ah, Second D's down. Spino using that money for good. Can't back yeah. up. <laughs> He's giving it to the, <laughs> giving it to the wanna, zebras out there. I still want to ask Coach, what do you got going on with this jogging suit, bro? I, 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 I got to figure it out. Think, <laughs> yeah. so, hey, guys, down. remember, Second don't down. forget we are live tomorrow as well for bracket play. It's single down. elimination, survive in advance. Down. Last team standing punches their ticket to the OT7 championship in June. You don't want to miss out on all the action, so make sure you guys like, subscribe, and tap in with us tomorrow hey, and that that championship's gonna be pretty early because we got a we got a rainstorm coming in so we do yeah so one, we're gonna be up a little bit earlier the time's two, gonna be a little bit uh sooner three. tomorrow we're gonna start at like 9 a.m or 9 30 maybe and what is the catch that. Miami Mortals is catching everything in contact Check. right now that was Elijah Hinton third wide receiver down, in the 24 down. class from Overton Florida we now have third and one we are gonna have a third down and short because that touch did third get down, in right game, when he caught 25. the ball this is a very third crucial down. down right here. Third and one, it's hard to guard short yardage yeah. situations, though, in seven on seven. There's just so many things that can happen so close to the line of scrimmage. I'm very curious. I mean, I assume they're going to keep it short here. Is it, are they bringing the blitz, you think? Pressure bring I the think blitz? I'm definitely bringing the blitz. Each team has two blitz, and there it is. Oh, no, you can't run the tackle box. That's a penalty. He was outside illegal. 
First down. They're saying that it was a legal one inside no, the tackle no, box. I would love to see a replay on that. I don't, I don't know if it was. I don't know about that one. I don't know. He went outside. I mean, he, he, he did not outside. go outside. I don't sure. think he was outside of that. He tried to get in here and see what's going on, bro. I'm not going to lie to you. I don't think he was outside. Hey, D needs to pay a little bit more money down there. I'm not going to lie. Oh, he was outside. No, no, Barely no, outside. No shot. That's crazy. He did think, go outside of the tackle box. He was, he was out. Now, is that really the tackle box? You do need to go outside of the hashes to be able to run. I don't like that. Each team gets two runs and two blitzes. Pressure used their one. Pressure used one of their blitzes right there. They picked it up. They're gonna That's give it to him. First down it. for Miami Immortals. I have noticed like Miami Immortals are also from Florida. We're in Florida right now. Two, I have noticed the teams have played three. better when they're at their home state. One hundred percent, except for uh, oh, oh my Houston. goodness. First down. Ooh. Ooh. Are they talking? Are they talking? Ooh. Big we hit like that. and they getting Ooh. into it. We like that. Yeah, Jalen Hayward just <laughs> five. The only five star on pressure just delivered an absolute smack. Like the contact right there. Georgia commit. Right here. There you go. Would you go to Georgia? Uh, I would absolutely would. Yeah, 100%. First and the bag is huge. First and goal. <laughs> the bag is huge in Georgia. Don't oh, ask me how man. I know. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> what the fuck? You tweaking. This quarterback looks legit, though, man. He's throwing dots. He's a know? freshman. He's Big out here. Points. He's out here balling. We haven't seen him yet. Darion Coleman. He's got offers already as a freshman to Ole Miss, Virginia Tech, and Marshall. I feel he's got insane confidence for a One, freshman. Ridiculous confidence for a freshman. Two, wow, look at that. Dot it right on. Just short inside the five-yard line. Second down. That's his favorite target right now. But I'll tell you what, Elijah Hinton and the Darion Coleman connection is, is working for Miami Immortals right now. I got a valid question to ask. Is it, is it too late to come back? Is it, is it over? Oh, they don't get it. Nah, it's, not, it's not too late. I think you, you need to score quickly, and then you need to get another stop. That's yeah, the only it, problem. It, I mean, it all comes down to this drive, right? If they can't yeah. get a stop here, I mean, it's, it's definitely over. Yeah. If I was Miami Immortals, I would have used a money drive on this one. They haven't been able to stop you, but one, we'll see next time I'd two. use a money drive. Actually, it's no, over. I wouldn't. It's, I would. over. It's, over. it's over now. <laughs> Touchdown for Miami Immortals. They get into the end zone again. That's Eric Hinton, Elijah Hinton, his brother. Uh, how y'all feel, feel, feel about the one-yard touchdown? Uh, I just think it's so exciting. Like, I think it meant a little extra to beat D and AJ's team. They're big on social media. Yeah, true. So I think it's more about that, honestly. Yeah. Good point. Hey, Good everyone point. in the chat, who do you blame more for this loss? You blame Money Money or, or, or AJ Green? Green. Who are you gonna blame in the chat? Money Let's uh, throw a ton of likes. It's Let's a tough debut. It's their debut. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna cut them some slack because they're my guys. It 100%. is their debut. It's a very new roster. They had to go out there. They only have Money nine drive. players, ten players on the team. We'll see what they can Look, do. Bro, D and AJ are content creators. Everyone loves an underdog and a comeback story. Exactly. So they can come back here. I think, like not in this game. Yeah, not in this tournament. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not in this tournament. We'll see what happens, but. We do have a money drive here for pressure. They're going for it. Ten points if they score a touchdown, but if they get stopped again, that's four points for the Miami Immortals. If they get picked off, it's six what? points for the Miami Immortals. When, when you score, or get a pick. What are, what are we doing? Right over the middle, Kai Barry Johnson. Right in the middle, right in the middle, right in the middle. Short little pickup. Hey, also, Honestly, here's the good news. Yeah. The first game of the day we saw with Cali Power versus uh, Bless. Yeah. That was 30 to 2. Mm -hmm. So pressure's playing way better than that. <laughs> They're doing a whole lot better than that. I will say this, though, about pressure. He, he has watched the past two tournaments. He's yep. called the past two tournaments. He's called the championship the past two tournaments. Why One, would you not build your offense two. around what Low Pro does? This is what, this is what Low Pro does say. right here. I, I, would, I would be eating just like Short. that. I'm surprised he didn't get Mikey Eugenio here, Low Pro quarterback. Oh, no, definitely. Right? He's recruiting the wrong players. I would have gotten all of those kids from Low Pro. Four minutes and 30 seconds on the clock. Third down now. It's going to be tough. We've mentioned Low Pro a ton now. For anyone that's just tuned in, we've had two OT7 tournaments in the past in Arizona and in Austin. And Low Pro. A team out of like Vegas slash Boy, Hawaii has won yeah. both of them. They're not here this weekend, though. So we're no, gonna they are not. Down, we will see them in the OT7 championship, though, in June. I do want to throw it down to Snipe. Snipe, what you got for us, brother? All right, man. I got Coach with me right now. Is it too late? Well, like, what y'all got to do, man? They Talk to me. It, it ain't too late to turn this thing around, though, is it? Got four minutes left on the clock. Uh, clock. Definitely not too late. One. The defense has got to settle down. Two, doing basic stuff. Three. Um, office is banging right now. Hopefully, we get this money drive. Never too late. Second get a stop down. on defense. Get this money ball. I think we'll be there on probably one touchdown. Second down. Touchdown. Exactly. What was the decision on going for the uh, one point gamble, though? The one point gamble we should have been a one point. I think they made it do a two point. I don't know what it was on that. But we just wanted to get points where we're at because we knew, you know, we're in a battle with these guys, a good team. So we just want to get points every opportunity we get points. You know, we're going to take the points just because we don't want to get too close. Take the points. We Second have down. Take the points. 
All right, cool. Hey, back to y'all at the booth, man. Appreciate you, Coach. Because of that one-point gamble one, failure, though, now two, whenever they do score, they're going to have to go for the one-point gamble again. Touchdown for pressure. Hey, I'll take it. I'll take it. The I'll take it. Zero. Second zero. touchdown in pressure 7v7 history. There it is. It's TJ Moore in the end zone again. Hey, man. 24-16, if they can get a quick stop. Yeah. It's, it's not like over. Low go, key. But they, they just have to stop the more. Yeah, they, they need let's to stop go, you. They, they desperately need to stop you. Well, they have to get one. I, need I was D. wrong on the math again. Goodness gracious. I need D and AJ chirping this freshman quarterback trying to get in the, get in his head a little bit. They really do. Snap. This is now or never for pressure. If they can come back, we counted them out. Yeah, I did. 15 snap. <laughs> we said it was over yeah, and everything. Ten this, snap. You know what's crazy is that they do play another game before D jumps in the booth, Five but snap. he's not going to be on here. Speaking of D, we got him right now with Snipe. What's going on? Fun. All right, man. Hey, y'all get a stop. Y'all score. Y'all can get back up in. Oh, oh my. Oh. Hey, never mind. Never mind. I mean, <laughs> hey, never mind. I mean, I mean hey, hey, I, I, I don't even. <laughs> I, bro, bro, I don't even know. Gotta give it to Mortos, they looking good, but we just gotta lock in and do a little better. It's our first spot, tournament. Spot. First time these guys go. playing together, first, first time the whole coach staff together. So, you know, we, we still learn a little growing pains, but it, today is just seeding day, so. You are, you are, you're right on the team. Seeding day, so y'all can still lock in, make adjustments, go forward. We will lock in. We will make adjustments. We will go about. forward. Come I'm on. talking about, come on, bro. Pass come on, bro. Only. Hey, look, he, he confident. What y'all think, bro? I, I like it. Yeah. I like it. It's the right attitude. I will say this, though, man. AJ Green, this is what, the third team that he sponsored? Third, nah, the third different seven on nah, seven. Nah, that's that's he's, nah. I'm like, he was with Trilly and he was with Dizzy. Now he's with now he's with them. I don't know what's going on, bro. I think there's another team in there too. Yeah, there's got to be another one in there too. And you know that one is like, hey, how you doing? Well, it's our first game. Yeah. <laughs> as soon as I, I was like, hey man, y'all still got a chance. They broke away for like 40 yards. Yeah, we're watching it right now. Skirt, skirt. skirt. I couldn't Barely even say anything, touch. bro. I was lost for words. I was just like, oh, I don't know, man. Two. Immortals trying to get in the end zone here wide open, and that is going to do it for this game. Miami Immortals in the end zone again. Jaden Ford, touchdown. They have spoiled the debut of pressure, 77. 31 to 16. Miami Immortals dominating right now. It's an old fashioned, bro. It's an old fashioned back alley. I think pressure will be all right. Oh, well, for sure. They'll be all right. It's, it's a debut. They need to get they need to get out there a little bit more. I'm curious, everyone in the chat, what they think uh, pressure needs to do to kind of you know, turn it around. Yeah, I think they need to recruit some of the best players on the other teams, <laughs> um, down, like they, like they have been trying to earlier on. Um, you know, but who knows? AJ might just make another team next week. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's dope is Miami Immortals. They've kind of last year OT7 Vegas. I think they flew in on a private jet. They were dancing and then they got smacked. They got yeah. They got upset by Low Pro, wasn't it? They got upset by one. Yeah. In the first couple of tournaments Two. this year, they've kind of gotten not not the best. Deep shot. Will this Ooh, finally be the sample again? Will this finally be the divisional that Miami Immortals plays well? Yeah, Zachary Sample. Yeah. Took a rough shot right there. Oh man. Yeah, we're gonna get checked on Zachary Sample there as the final whistle blows. Miami Immortals spoil the debut of pressure, 31 to 16. Guys, make sure you guys stay tuned. Our fan favorites are coming up next. We got SMSB facing off against the Legends. Don't go anywhere. We got coverage for you all weekend. OT7, the best seven on seven tournament you've ever seen. Don't go away, stay right there. We'll be right back. Sorry, D. <laughs> All right, Joey, you're running a button hook, all right? Tommy, back quarter fade. Billy, you're gonna pump fake and then hit. Coach, you don't remember my name, do you? I got 12 touchdowns this year. That's a rookie mistake. You're gonna hit Nick. Nick, that's who you're gonna hit. Snickers, official chocolate of OT7. Overtime Tom here for a break in the action. A turnover can change the momentum of an entire game. If there's one weak link, the whole team suffers. So remember, vapes can contain toxic chemicals that can irreversibly damage your lungs and the team. Let's head back to the action. 
Welcome back to Orlando, Florida for the OT7 East Divisional. It is hot. It is humid, and we got some spicy games out on the field today. We are here for bracket play at single elimination. One of these teams will be punching their ticket to the OT7 Championship in June. And next up, we have a very highly anticipated matchup, a rematch from yesterday. We have pressure destroying an AJ Green's newly minted team facing off against the team that smacked them around yesterday, Miami Immortals. I'm your main man, Kieran. I am joined here by Overtime Tom. Tom, how you feeling today? I'm nervous for D. I'm very nervous for D as well. <laughs> this game is going to be really interesting. They did get smacked around yesterday, but I want to see what happens out here. Tell us what we should be looking out for. Hey, look, pressure and D, they stole Zachariah Sample from Mississippi Heat, and he was a little quiet yesterday, so I'm looking for him to have a big game. And like we said, D showing, AJ Green, they got a brand new team. Can, can pressure, can they perform under pressure? And last but not least, Darian Coleman, New quarterback for the Miami Immortals. He played great yesterday. I'm looking yeah. for him to keep that keep that going. It's a freshman. I love it. Only a freshman. Miami Immortals. He looked really, really solid. I'm interested to see what can happen here. You know, we've been really nervous about D. It's been pretty tough. You know, I'm, I, 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 you know I want to root for his team so bad. But they he have like 10 up, players on the He team. showed up earlier today than normal. <laughs> and yeah. I was like, did you not sleep well? No, nah, it's been. <laughs> you just been up all night thinking about this? I'm not sure. So. It's been pretty tough. We got 22 minutes on the clock. Raw Miami, One. I'm sorry, not Raw Miami, Miami Immortals pressure going Three. off. Miami Immortals taking the first snap. Easy completion over the middle. And there's our main man with the easy completion, Darian Coleman, only a freshman a from Orlando, Florida. And we saw in the first game of the day, Trillium boys, they changed up their, their play calling, right? Mm -hmm. Josh Stupin stepped aside with someone else to call the plays. I'm wondering, are D and AJ Green going to jump in today and be like, hey, I'll call the plays today. Wow, I that's think that would that's be not the recipe for success. Yeah, I, mean, yeah. I think that would be really bad. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what D would would, would call out there. Hey, we he, gotta, he's going to call the uh, was it the transfer? What was it the annexation of Puerto Rico? That's, <laughs> yeah, what, he's gonna call. that's what they're going to call out there. You guys are hearing from our man Sniper down the field. Sniper, how you doing, man? Two, I'm good, man. I got an amazing three. view of this top 100 talent in the building. The jerseys. Can we talk about the jerseys now? Because now now we got a discussion on our hands, right? Yeah, talk about it, man. Okay, so I don't like Miami uh, Immortals jerseys at all, but. <laughs> <laughs> but that don't mean I don't like pressures, man. I love the pressure uniform, bro. It's the 90s iconic Orlando. Kind of cliche because we in Orlando, but I like the, the magic, though. They got the pinstripe jerseys. Mismatch from the shirts and the pants. I think I think they got the best jerseys out here right now, man. I'm not gonna best jerseys, talking. not the best team. Oh, yeah. okay. 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 Goodness, I, like, gracious, just, Tom, the random shot Starting the insane. shots already, Tom. <laughs> Look, man, I just, I call it as a scene. It is what it is, you know? I, I respect oh, the honesty, though. I'm hopefully, they, they got a little bit more chemistry last night at the hotel. Oh, well, I guess my not. Goodness. Touchdown for Miami Immortals. They take an early lead over pressure, and they're jumping in the pit. That's the pass for the Miami Immortals. That was a really easy drive. 7-0 early. You know, if you're D and AJ, what do you do, man? What do you do? I haven't even seen AJ here yet. Is he I know AJ, AJ's down there. He's in the hoodie. <laughs> Down. Oh, what, what kind of content do you make when your team's getting smacked around like this? Yeah, you know. Well, look, I've been saying that both those guys should get into boxing. Maybe Ooh. that's their sport. That would be interesting. <laughs> a D versus AJ Green boxing match would be really fun. Ooh, but I think that would be a good one. I think I got D taking that one. Going over some of the rules here at OT7, a touchdown. You will be rewarded with seven points. You do have an opportunity to go for what is called the one-point gamble. If you do score and you want to go for the one-point gamble, you will be rewarded with eight points for that drive if you get it and six points if you don't. Also, if you get a defensive stop, that's two points for your team. An interception, three points. And we also have what's called the what, Tom? Money drive! We have the money drive. <laughs> Goodness gracious. On the money drive, if you score a touchdown, One, you'll be rewarded with 10 points. Two, if you get a stop defensively, three, four points and six points for an interception on the money drive. That is a nice catch and a first down for pressure, moving the ball downfield. Seems like Jake Merklinger's got a little bit of rhythm going. This kid's going to Tennessee. He's a really solid quarterback. I love him. He plays great. And look, we got the chat going right now on YouTube. 71% of people just voted said pressure is going to win this game. So. Hey, Tom. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to be interested to see. You're the only 10 I see, buddy. One. That was two, cute. That was cute. Three. I love you, Snake. Back to football. We got <laughs> 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 Dustin Fletcher says D would piece AJ up all day. Ooh. It's going to be interesting. She's going to instigate a fight between two friends. I've been trying to get What's D to fight for years. Result? Not me, personally. 
Well, he needs to fight for a bigger roster. Like, uh, that's <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm not going to lie, bro. I stayed up late last night, and I was like, am I going to pick pressure to win it all today? Am I going to yeah, make that bold board. claim? And I'm really happy. I, I want to see pressure go as far as possible. What's going to happen if pressure yeah. pressure gets a little bit oh, further in this tournament, think? you know? I think we lose D as a yeah, yeah, we I think we're going to lose D. I'm not sure what's going to happen. <laughs> now, of course, we will. D showing actually will be jumping in the booth right after this game and taking on the rest of the day. Yes. As long as his team uh, doesn't win. Yeah, you, will, you will hear more from him later on in this day. We promise. Mark Linker going downfield. Oh, oh, nice little head. That's tough. Oh, that is TJ tough. TJ Moore. He has been a problem all week. Pressure jumping oh, in the yeah, pit yeah, for the yeah, first time. Someone get D out of there, man. <laughs> hey, hey, just let me know. If anybody find D's watch, uh, I'm telling you, <laughs> hey, if this watch is in the pit, I ain't going to hold you. I'm looking for yeah, that I found thing. it at the dollar store. AJ wasn't going to jump in the pit because he wasn't trying to have that velvet first come down. off his head. I'm telling you right now. Man, good job, Pressure. Is that their first touchdown first on field down. one? I think that is. I think that's that's either their first or second. That's the first time jumping in the pit, though, for sure. <laughs> Definitely the first time jumping in the pit for Pressure out there. Yeah, I think they scored yesterday, but they were getting smacked, so they didn't go They didn't go foam pit. It's going to be interesting to see what they do here defensively. They haven't been able to really buy a stop. <laughs> hey, by the way, I want to give a big shout out to Strictly Football. You guys see him on TikTok and everywhere. They actually stole A.J. Green's uh, chain. You can see the guy wearing it behind the quarterback there. Fun. Yeah, he's got the big old chain on his neck, and that's uh, A.J.'s that he stole. I love it. Yeah. Found it and took it a while while last night. Nothing we love more than a good thief. Yep. It's a good time. <laughs> Miami Immortals trying to move the ball. 24K getting some Gatorade in their system. Got to get hydrated. Gotta get hydrated. Look at that. They played a really solid game, having a comeback victory over Trillian. Really sensual shot from 24K. <laughs> That's crazy. It's like one of the Michael Jordan commercials. I was like, sweat. Right over the middle. Very short game there for Trillian. Or not for Trillian, for Miami Immortal, sorry. Yo, you got Trillian on your mind. Guys. I really do. I, I have Trillian. I'm, I'm upset they lost. You know, Juju's my boy. What do you think Josh Stupin's doing right now? Uh, <laughs> he might be, I don't know. That's a million dollar question. That's a $50,000 question. <laughs> That's hey, how much hey, they lost to take some receipts <laughs> to have that exact number. Y'all locked in on fifty thousand. I don't know what y'all seen. You think about it, all right? You got twenty five people you fly across. That's a that's a thousand dollar round trip. Plus you get three nights in a hotel. That's a thousand each, bro. That's a twenty five thousand. That's a fifty thousand dollar hell they just took yesterday. That's tough. good math, bro. That's good math. I can't even argue. You know, it is what it is. And I heard Stephen only does penthouse. Hey, that, hey, that's penthouse way to live. for him or penthouse for the team. But they're trillionaires. Just him, just him. You know what I mean? They are trillionaires. Just him. <laughs> Miami Immortals trying to get Let's something cooking here on second down. Freshman quarter. Oh, oh, interception! Oh, pressure hey, to the pit. That's that pressure. Hey, right back to the pit. Pressure came hey, to hey, play. Hey, these boys locking in right now. AJ Green is in the pit. AJ Green might get his chain back. He's about to get the chain get the on chain him. Back. Oh there my goodness. Go. Read it like a book. Easy pick. Marco Jones, what an interception. That kid is 6'4", 215 pounds. That's a hard area to throw past. First down. Look at us hating our pressure. First Look at him down. in the pit. Bro, that's the fastest D's ran since he was in college. Oh, man. Hey, yeah, honestly, <laughs> he's a fast dude, though. He's, he's a scary fast dude. Wow. So pressure up 10-7. They got the ball. What? See what they can do offensively. Jake Merkinger drops back. Hey, let me back. see that chain. Let me see that chain before you take off. Finds CJ Moore over the top. TJ Moore, rather. Snipe, you going to jump in the. Uh, Let's go. Come on, man. With that next time? It, it, not at all. Everybody's 6'5. I'm not one. getting in there. No, nah, you need to jump in there one time, Snipe. I'm not, I'm not getting in there. Live a little. We need, we need to see a vibe cam footage of, of someone jumping in the pit. I need it. Second down here for pressure. Snipe, what's going on down there, brother? Two. All right, man, I see you with the ice on. You know what I'm saying? You just ate a donut, which is the most random thing of all time. What's the energy right now? Y'all came out balling. It's great. Come on. We had a nice talk last week. Yesterday, I mean, you know, just we just had to get a dub. We're going to the championship. We, we got to give it our all. We had bad energy yesterday. We got to turn it up. A lot of people, especially the people, you see that green tent right there, that booth over there, those two guys? See, they don't think y'all good. You know what I'm saying? They, they don't think y'all got a chance of winning. What you got to tell them directly? We the best. We the best one here. You know, we knew. I get that. But 
we had the most talented squad, and we we already mentioned it's only our second day meeting each other. Y'all heard it here. They, they, they the best team out here, bro. Now, now what exactly did y'all do yesterday as far as like team bonding? And do you think it really is paying off today? Yes, sir. All we did was just hang out in the crib. That's it. Talking out, just talk. You know, got to know each other. You know, just talk about like took took accountability for ourselves and others, and that's it. That's all it takes. Teamwork made the dream work. Like in, bro. Back to y'all at the booth. My boy just got there eating a Krispy Kreme donut. Yeah, he was out of breath eating a donut. It was hey. a tough situation. Oh, oh, oh they balling. The oh, they balling. They balling, bro. Did they call the touchdown. They did. He held on yeah. to it. Zachariah Sandy in the pit, destroying the pit. He just did a swamp Tom bump. Hey, pressure came to play today. We were hating on him, man. I'm not sure if that was a catch, though. I think he's. I think he's. What's down? Yeah, ball came he's out straight. later. I like it. I like it as a catch. Pressure came to play. This is the same team that smacked them around yesterday, Miami Immortals. So big time adjustments. Maybe pressure can make a run at this time. It's hard to beat a team twice, man. What's D looking for? D, what we lose? Yo, Snipe, what's going on down there? Hey, hey, I, I, I got AJ with me. I see the energy high. You handing out the chain. Talk to me, bro. Are we win? <laughs> what, what does that even mean, bro? Are we win? Hey, look, bro. I heard that y'all did some bonding yesterday, some team bonded type Touchdown. activities. Is that paying Touchdown. off big time right now? Absolutely. Set on seven is all chemistry and energy and momentum. And we just did all of that yesterday. We got the kinks out. We vibed at the crib. Came Boy. out here. Showing yourself. Dude. Last thing, bro. I see you ain't jumping the pit last time. You getting tired of jumping in the pit, bro? What's up, bro? Oh, oh my oh, goodness. Oh, oh, oh no, D oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, you do your thing. We got I'm gonna get back to you. Yeah, you can handle that. You can handle that. We got a situation going on right now. The pit destroying and they were in there looking for something. And now there's a touchdown catch by Immortals and more chaos in the pit. We got a whole pit situation going on down here, man. Let's take another look at this touchdown catch. I was interviewing, I didn't see the catch, bro, and now I'm sick. I heard what it an adjustment. Unbelievable okay, catch. Okay, don't make it sound that good. Cameron Sapp. What a, the most insane catch you've ever seen in your oh, entire on, life. Bro. Come on, The most ridiculous, unbelievable catch. Money falls out of his pocket. Oh, what? Do you see the money fall out of his pocket? <laughs> on the catch, this dude had $17,000 fall out of his pocket. <laughs> You know, it's crazy. What a catch. You mentioned it. Destroying was in here looking for his football. Yeah, if we, you take a look down at the pit, we have we have overtime day down here searching for something Boy. in the pit. Yeah, it's, it's uh, precious football. I don't know what they're playing with now, but they lost their ball. They must have lost their football. That's a tech, ain't Day's it? down there looking for it. <laughs> that's, a, that's a tech, ain't it? Hey, what that is, bro? That was a hard shove right there. Flag on the field. 33. Hard hey, shove. Ain't no hard. That's a tackle, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, overtime day found the football. There we go. There we go. Overtime day. Will he throw it this time? Will he throw it this time? Derry, let that Darryl. thing rip. Yesterday, <laughs> overtime day had an opportunity here to throw the football back to the ref, and he did not take it. He, Look at uh, him. Real quarterback right there. Some people live for that moment, man. He's they just somebody. Like, snooze let the that thing launch. There it oh, is. Oh, there it goes. Tight spiral. Oh, oh. He's a baseball player. Did he, did he just flex he for an incomplete pass? Yeah. He did. He did. To be he fair, it wasn't on him. It wasn't on him. Oh, it, it definitely was. Too much mustard on that one. <laughs> Pressure moving the ball downfield with a three-point advantage. Coach OTB said earlier this week they only want to use their money drive Whoa. when they're oh, – Oh! A little what trickery. a run! Ooh, a little trickeration there. We haven't seen much of that here at OT7. He must have read that text I sent him. I sent him that play. Hey, there you go. <laughs> that was Kelly Barry Johnson, wide receiver from Chicago, Illinois. He scored in almost every game in Phoenix for another team, Deuces. Second That's down. <laughs> yeah, this is one of AJ's uh, 19 teams. Yeah, one of, one of AJ's. He's got a long portfolio. Yeah, he might have more teams than Karen. Ain't that right, Karen? Cowboys. Oh, yeah, Kansas Cowboys, City. Chiefs. I used to be a Packers fan as well. You know, I'm, I'm the bandwagon king. If you go on AJ Green's LinkedIn, it's just like <laughs> it's not that much teams. teams. <laughs> Blitz for oh, pressure. They beat my. it. Kyberry Johnson just oh, got, short of him, the end zone. Right, right, right before, they got him right before. Pressure came to play today, fellas. They look great. Yeah, on they them. look phenomenal hey, they one right blitz. now. We got on the hair. We got on the on the Immortals first got one hair. blitz left after using that one, man. So I wonder how they're gonna that's try to tough, use it. That's a tough. That's a tough thing using those blitzes and not getting them. As you see, the blitz right there comes from a little bit of a delay. Merklinger rolls out. Phenomenal play to beat the blitz right there. Kyberry Johnson almost gets in the end zone. Just gets touched short right there. First down from the three-yard line, rather, two-yard line, rather. 
Merklinger rolling out to his right. He has him right over the middle. Oh, oh my goodness. Almost picked off. Throwing across the body. Dangerous. That would have been a fireable offense. I think if he would have stayed with his Second first down. read, he would have got open on the outside. I'm not going to lie to you. Hey, this QB is tall, too, man. I know that's a huge advantage being able to read over these people yeah, because yeah. the DBs on these teams are tall as hell. Not, not exactly Miami, but uh, today. The teams out here today, these DBs are tall, bro. So it pays off to have a tall quarterback. Yeah. Well, Jake Merklinger, I mean, he's a high-ranked four-star in the class of 2024. He's going to Tennessee to play with Joe Milton and Nico Yamaliava, like two of the best quarterback talents that you've seen arm-wise in college football this, this upcoming season. And a touchdown right there. Gage Nix in the end zone for pressure. He's all right. Pressure. No pit talk right now. It's all focus. Bring the song, pressure 24. There you go. Pressure's applying that pressure today. They're up 10. You know what that means, right? It means I might think. Is, is a money drive coming, Tom? Is a money drive coming? It's got to be. It's got to be a money drive it's here, no? Be. I'm just saying, y'all been wrong 17 ball. times out of 17 times, so I don't really know. Hey, I money see the golden ball snipe. Oh, yep, yeah, it is a money drive. That's what I'm talking about, right? That's money one drive. out of 18. Thank you very much. We got a money drive on the field. If a score happens here, for Miami Immortals, you get a 10 points for that drive. Snipe, you got D down there. What's going on? Hey, D, y'all turned up today, bro. Y'all got set to me today. You feeling, you feeling good today. Oh! Oh, oh so came close. Out with a pick, boy. Come on, I'm telling you. It's a whole new pressure, boy. Now, you know who up there at the booth, right? Look, look, look up there. You, you see Karen? You see, you see Tom? One in the nation. <laughs> hey, hey. You gotta be one in the nation. They was talking greasy, saying y'all wasn't going to win. Keep talking. We're hearing all that. All right, now look. <laughs> players telling me that the team bonding experience that y'all had is really paying off. You know what I'm saying? Um, what, what you got? What you think about it? It was amazing, bro. We got to bring the guys together. Obviously, seven on seven is different. They don't get to practice each other, nothing. But we all got together yesterday at the house. Everything's out. What can we fix? What can we do better? Got to know each other. And you see, it's paying Whoa, off. Crazy. I didn't get an invite. Last thing, you you didn't jump in the pit yeah, three times, bro. Oh, 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 oh,
pressure the 14 point lead. Third down here for Jake Markinger. I think the underseen story here is, is the offensive coordinator is back out here with sweats and a hoodie again. <laughs> I don't think nobody talking about that. At least it's not an orange one like yeah, this. It's not all orange, but it's still just as flagrant as it was. Hey. Oh, oh, they caught him. He jumped. They caught him. He oh, jumped. God. They pick up the necessary five yards, oh, destroying his laughing at him on the field. First the down and that was they last for they pressure. Too, that was they last hey, let's first give a quick down. shout out to Cow Monkeys, which is a very interesting name. We love that. Also, Joshi IDC says pressure to the chip. Could pressure actually win a championship? Are they showing you enough that you think they actually have a chance to win a championship? They're showing me that they're a capable team they're, today. I will say they have an easier side of the bracket. So if they win this, they'll likely play the number two seed, Team Tampa. Now. Yes. Who didn't? Re they have to win. Team Tampa has to beat a, a lower seed first, but they didn't. They weren't really tested yesterday. I would say it's a a two seed that maybe hasn't earned it all the way. It's so gonna be interesting to see what they do. I I don't I don't I don't, I don't know the chances to be honest. With you. <laughs> but, but if they play I'm still like this, if they play like this defensively, I think they have a yes. chance for sure. They're doing what they're supposed to be doing. They're taking the short, easy, intermediate routes. They're not taking too many deep, crazy shots. And when they are, they're going to their big target. So there's a higher percentage of those plays being made. I don't know. They're in a root. They're in a rhythm right now. They're in a groove. I still think they could get sample involved a little bit more. They still could. I mean, he has a touchdown catch. Tom, what more do you want? Like three. Okay. Makes sense. <laughs> he, that's what he was doing for Heat. Hey, now. what time is it? It's 11 a.m. I just ate my first Snickers. There you go. It was amazing. How many Five, did you put down seven. yesterday? Like 17. One. <laughs> and I feel two. better than ever. 11. That's a touchdown. Hey. That's a touchdown. That's a dot. Jake the Brinklinger. They're going to the pit. Everybody's there. Pressure is in complete control. Absolutely dominating. <laughs> AJ Green, is he going in the pit? Is he jumping? Is he jumping? He's hey! going to AJ in the pit! Look at this replay. Just an absolute dime right there. Kyan Barry Johnson, he's having himself a day. I'll tell you what, these three wide receivers they have are making incredible plays. Zachariah Sample, TJ Moore, Kyan Barry Johnson, they are doing what they're supposed to be doing. There's AJ Green jumping into the pit. Make sure you have that do-rag on tight so the hairline doesn't get ruined. <laughs> hey, and, and it's not just any do-rag. It's the velvet joint. You know what I'm saying? the velvet joint. It's, look, 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 look. It's stylish. He got the silky do on, bro. Yeah, he, got that, he, got that, he got that smooth velvet on. So, yeah, you, you definitely need a lint roller if you, if you wear that the wrong way, 100%. That's hey, all man. that material getting caught on that do-rag, bro. The chat is starting to get pumped, saying pressure could win it all. We got MSM Landon saying easy championship or pressure today. You know what, man? We, we gave these so much flag yesterday and today, you know. I got I to gotta get pressure some. I got to get pressure some. So they look great. They, win they look great. They look phenomenal today. Absolute blowout, too. 35-14. It's crazy. Just given what happened yesterday in the game. Mortals rolls out. Going to go out of bounds. Only 10 seconds remaining in this game. Clock running down. And that is going to end this one. AJ Green destroying, get Time it done. They send Miami Mortals home. Time out with one second. Team Time pressure. Out. Oh, they call the timeout with Time one second remaining. Time out. Time out. Time out. Time out. Oh, man. Timeout, Time out. one second. Here you go, coach. Everyone's saying pressure to the chip. Zay, Krupp's better. Pressure First to the chip. Bobby yeah. Allen. Dustin Fletcher. Dustin Fletcher, I, I, pressure will likely play Team Tampa. It's undecided. We have to figure out who they're going to play against, but they'll likely play the number two seed, Team Tampa, in the next round. We got one more here play go. here, here in this game, First down. celebratory fashion. One more untimed down, essentially. One hey, second left hey, on the Dapa clock. Hey, wants AJ to show the hairline. Thoughts? Hey, if, if, <laughs> hold on. I'll tell you this. If, if pressure wins this, win, wins, wins this entire competition here today, if they win this divisional, yep. I need AJ to, to take off the dude. I need you to. You got to take it off. Just one time. If they win today, you got to take it off. They win the chip. I, I, I'm willing to bet $100,000 that AJ does not have do-rags. Uh, he does not have waves, and he wear a do-rag every single day. <laughs> I am willing to gamble my life that there is not one wave under that do-rag. Uh, listen, I've seen AJ on numerous occasions. I've never seen him with a brush. There's no way he has waves He probably like got Kevin Durant. Oh, that's game. Almost got the highlight reel off, but good defense. Pressure strapped up, and they get this one done. They win the game 35 
to 14. Pressure is moving on here at OT7 East. Guys, don't go anywhere. Next up, we have more matchups, and we're going to have Day and Destroying in the booth for you guys. Make sure you guys stay around to tap in to hear what Destroying has to say about his team's win out here at OT7. After review, the ruling on the field stands. Clean catch. First down. Yeah, I don't know about that one. He's following me on IG, so clean catch. Gotta remember to turn your mic off. That's a rookie mistake. Snickers, official chocolate of OT7. Overtime Tom here for a break in the action. A turnover can change the momentum of an entire game. If there's one weak link, the whole team suffers. So remember, vapes can contain toxic chemicals that can irreversibly damage your lungs and the team. Let's head back to the action. Yo, 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 what is going on? Welcome to OT7 Season 2. We are live from Orlando, Florida for the OT7 East Divisional, and we are in bracket play. We've got the 10 seed Pressure Elite versus Team Tampa. Now, Team Pressure is coached by my co-host, co-announcer, Young Destroying, and he's up here in the booth with me. I'm Overtime Day. D, we have playoffs, and you're not down there with the field. You're in the booth with me, pacing back and forth you see like me a pacing, boxer, bro. ready to go into the ring. I'm supposed to be out there, man, but you know, I, I, I made a commitment to overtime. I got to be up here broadcasting, and, so and, I watch my team from above. Am bro. I just going to be the voice of reason this broadcast, and you're going to be the I'm coach, gonna be coaching talking from here? Smack on Tampa, just know that. <laughs> Let's take a look at the bracket right now. Pressure Elite facing Team Tampa, the two seed. Yes, the sir. winner of this will face the winner of Cali Power and Raw Miami. Sir. The Legends just punched their ticket to the Final Four after beating 24K. And then in a little bit, Gridiron Elite versus DEFCON 1. Yes, sir. And they'll face the winner of Legends. But right now, it's all about Pressure Elite Team Tampa. This is the first weekend of Pressure Elite. And you guys have had a far. plethora of wins so far, huh? We've had a plethora for sure. We've had a plethora for sure, man. Just one, but Guys, you know, I'm not doing gonna, it with the words it's today. Gonna be <laughs> hey, they gave us a list of words to use, fam, so this guy whipped out plethora. Wow, you're going to expose me that quickly. Already. That quickly. Good tag off, baby. Good tag Second off, baby. D, can I get a score prediction? A win versus a loss. I'll give you that. A pressure win. <laughs> We're going to score at least three. Like that. What? Oh, they're going quick. We can't whip his ass. Wow. We got a little dump off off the rip here. So, Team Tampa in the name, obviously, from Florida. But they, they've looked pretty good so far. They've looked pretty good. They come in as the two seed. D, what's your nervous level right now? I'm not nervous at all, man. I'm just anxious, eager. I feel like I should be out there. The team need my energy. You know, I, I like getting them hype. Bro, I am gripping the look, table. Look how I'm you're gripping, holding yeah. on to the table. Yeah. No, I, I ain't nervous. I'm just hyped, anxious, watching the ball. You're sweating like Shaq. At Give us that! Oh, no! Come on, man! Oh, baby! Come on, man! Turnover on down, so tack on two. Stop playing with him! Elite almost reeled in by He's going to be the most Dillon. biased Dillon. broadcast Dillon. ever. <laughs> and I'm in y'all ear yelling all game. You're going to have to turn me down oh, for this. he would have snagged that thing? Take I'm another my voice look. Meet you. Let's go, boy. I ain't sitting all game either. So a touchdown is worth seven. Turnover on downs is worth two. A pick we'll is worth three. We'll take that. So with the turnover, I don't know if you'll ever hear a game broadcasted by the owner of the team. <laughs> <laughs> just, I told you. I wear a lot of hats, Ridiculous. Man. Just ridiculous. And just know, if we score, I'm going to so, D, tell me a little bit about your quarterback, Jake Boy, Merlinger. He's him. It's Merklinger. We call him Big Merk. Excuse me. Big we Merk? We call him Big Merk. Tennessee commit. That boy balling. Doing his thing. Balling. Four-star QB from Savannah, Georgia. Dog. Basketball and lacrosse. Dog. And he's gone 29-9 and nine in three years as QB <laughs> for his high school. And more importantly, he's D's dog. Dog. <laughs> you know, 
I'm turned. Hey, I'm, I'm, turn up with me one time. Spell I'm, the does in the chat, man. We turned up. I don't Teed know if up, I should way. play the heel role and root for Team Tampa to oppose Give me that. you. I don't know. Do it if you want. Nah, there's a biased <laughs> broadcast today. Do it if you want. We all stick together. Gage Nix brings <laughs> team pressure inside, or excuse me, just outside the 10 yard line. Are they giving them a new set of downs here? First down. AD, they are first down. Sorry, Tom, go on. How's your offensive coordinator wear a whole sweatsuit, man? He just does it, man. He's on fire, that's why. He does it. He does it. I don't know how I asked him yesterday. He was in an orange jumpsuit. I was like, I know you sweat. I know you hot. But he's like, yeah, I am, but it's okay. Big Merc looking over the middle. All good, all good. Hey, good decision, baby. Good decision. Good decision. Don't rush it. Don't make no dumb plays, dumb throws, throw a pick. Good stuff. Good stuff. Coaching from the booth. Young destroying. D, tell me about who you have coaching alongside you. We got Mr. AJ Green, of course, my dog. Was my arch nemesis, but now we, you know, business partners work together. We have Coach Zayshawn, a.k.a. Zach, as our offensive coordinator. We got Coach Cam Gaddis, our defense coordinator. We got Coach OTB, our head coach. We got me, the hype man. <laughs> we got my dog, Mike Swift. He's just our business Two. manager. Shout out, Swift. We got, we got a lot of things, man. Oh, Ooh. that's a flag. Throw the flag. Throw the flag. No flag. First down, no first down. I like how you said arch nemesis, and instead, normally when people said, used to be my arch nemesis, then they're like, used to be my arch nemesis, now my now my boy. You're like, used to be my arch nemesis, now, now my business my partner. He's my dog, now, he's my dog. <laughs> now my we dog. have similar business interests. You guys interests. are like Logan Paul and KSI, man. He's my dog, you feel me? Low <laughs> key, right? To make money. <laughs> so we have a 22 minute running clock here at OT7 up until the final minute for bracket play. So with pressure up to nothing, they'll look to make this a nine nothing game early. Big Merc drops back. Let's see who he's got. Three. Oh, 11. 11. And a flag. Thank you. We'll take it. 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 Okay. We got Cayenne Berry in the back of the end zone open, but all good. Cayenne Pepper. The we'll take the hold. <laughs> Thank you. Go Give me that. Give me that. Is pressure in the next tournament? Of course. So we'll take a look at the penalties here. We got holding on the defense. So that's five yards replay down. It'll remain. They asked me if we snatched Zamp Sample. Hell yeah, we took Zach Sample. Of course, he's a dog. We got a lot of dogs. You've been, all you've been high the board. on Zach Sample since, since the beginning forever, of the OT7 since season. before OT7, because I've seen him at Jackson State balling out. Mm -hmm. He won my one on ones that we were never able to put out because compliance reasons. Lame. I've been seeing him. Dog. He got his first offer because of me. Look at him. Big Look, at him. Look at him! Look at him! I'm going to the, booth. to the booth. D's to the booth. D's to the booth. This man just throwing that. And D's in the booth. Hey, Dave, if they win, I think I need you in the in the down there, too. 100%. 100%. <laughs> I got you! Take another look right here. Zach Sample, a little double move. Too easy. Let's go. Had to go in the pit, boys. The three-star committed to Arizona State from Katy, Texas. Now, he was electric for Heat 7-on-7 seven seven for OT7 South in Austin. And D said, I need a pick. D said, hey, son, how would you like to come play for pressure? Come play for pressure. Come play for pressure. <laughs> come to the dark side. <laughs> hey, Tom, what's going on down there? Hey, I'm down here with my man, Zachariah Sample. D's listening, bro. He's hyped for you guys. How we feeling? Yeah, I'm feeling great, man. We finna come out here and win this whole thing. We had a long team meeting yesterday. We found all the mistakes that we had to do to mm. win this thing today. What were you guys talking about in that team meeting? All the mistakes that we did today, what we didn't communicate uh -oh. on. Uh-oh. Oh, they scored. No, he's Zach's short. Zach's no, he's short. short. He's, short. No, he's short. He's short, Zach. That's Joshua You're Robinson. You're good. Hey. You got destroying over there. You guys had a nice bond. He got you on, on his team. Tell me a little about you guys. Me and him been close since Jackson State, man. That's my boy. All day. That's my boy, man. All right, man. We love it. Doing his thing. Back to you That's guys. That's my dog. See, we can't beat ourselves up. Big play is going to happen. It's going to happen as part of the game. We just got to communicate and figure out what we did wrong. Touchdown oh, over the middle. Who mans? Joshua who mans? Robinson. Who mans? Makes the... Oh, excuse me. That was Eric Fletcher. Joshua Robinson on the big catch. Eric Fletcher on the touchdown. And we have a 9-7 to seven ball game. Not a lot of defense so far early. We got to talk, y'all boys. We got to talk. Coach OTB must be losing not a lot of defense. You see that. that nine up there? <laughs> I mean, we got two, right? Okay. 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 <laughs> He's checking me in the booth. Okay. He's checking me. It's all good. It happens. It happens. Eric. Have you seen AJ's hairline? Yeah, I think I was the first one to see it. <laughs> 
Eric Fletcher, class of 2024 from Fort Myers, Florida. Hey, by the way, fellas, we just saw Cali Power over here. They're playing Raw on field two already. Mm. The game's going on right now. I believe Cali Power is up three to two. So we're a real barn burner on, the, on field two right Overtime now. Overtime Tom, our very own Adam One, Schefter of OT7, two. breaking news on the fly. And here's a deep shot, and we have a duck in the air. <laughs> Knocked down. Who's throwing for double coverage? Uh, ugly pass by your boy Big yeah. Merck there. Yeah, that's a double coverage, man. It's all good. It's going to happen. We good. We good. We good. Tampa think they're getting the momentum in their favor right now. Hell no. We're about to shut that down. So, D, we saw Zachariah sample. We've seen Big Merck throw it around. Who are some of your other wideouts that you're most Everybody. excited about? Everybody. Everybody. TJ Hart. Kyan Hart. Yep. Zach Hart. Yep. Everybody. Whole team, man. One, Whole team hard. Two, three. <laughs> Dropping back. Across the middle. Looking middle. So, hey, hey, throw that. Throw that. Give me that. No, there come on, bro. Thank you. A little late long jump on the you. field. Hey, lucky I'm not on that field, but I would have been. What would you have done? What would you have done, big guy? That, what would you have done? That ref's grill, <laughs> Are they going all the way from that backfield to the pit? That's crazy. Middle of a game. Look at wow. It. Middle of a game. Disrespect. Okay. They got to be some type of something. They're waving off this flag, fellas. Nah, they want no flat. They want hey, no flat. Hey, meanwhile, you guys see right next to you, Cali Power just That's came and ran from field two to hey, the pit. Hey, stay on my game, fam. Watch out. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Cali Power scoring on Raw Miami, running across field one to go crazy. in the pit. I actually believe it was just an interception. I know they tired. Okay, then it makes D sense. Defensive squad. <laughs> yeah, over. yeah, that makes sense. I would have done the same thing too. They come 13 to minutes left. Here's the blitz. Caught. Ooh, Kyan Berry. Dangerous. Kyan Berry Kyan. Johnson. <laughs> Turn around down, Dan. Oh, good. The juice is not worth the oh, squeeze. Oh, good. And Team Line Tampa up. will take over. I know. Defense got to come out and apply that pressure right here, man. Mm. Nine nine game. Nearing the halfway point I need to be so there with far. My team, man. I need to be there with my team. Oh, Taking a wow. shot deep. He's got his man wide open. Touchdown, team, team Tampa. Tampa. And to the pit, they go. I already know it. The Damian Farrell reels it in. What a throw, what a catch, and Team Tampa with 16 unanswered points to take All good. the lead. Mm. All good, we bouncing back, we good, we good, it happens. We have, it happens, it happens. I gotta be out there, man. <laughs> My quarterback, Here we go. Let's my go. quarterback. Let's go out there, bro. <laughs> the 2024 wide out just from Tampa, Florida, 59160, and he got open in a blur. It just blurred us. One. There's more Two. pressure on pressure. It's all good, man. Three. Pressure make diamonds, my Second boy. Down, you see man. the diamonds on our jerseys? Second down. They make diamonds, my boy. Barry Johnson with the catch. It's all good. Y'all saying they're getting exposed. Who's going to burst 11 minutes in the game? Do y'all know how this works? There's money ball still available. There's all types of stuff, man. So, hey, Coach D, when would you when would you use your money Not drive? this one. Next one. Next one? Okay. Not this one, next we, one. We haven't seen one, either so far. We've seen two. some blitzes. We've Oh, he misses his man open there. First down, first down. D, it looks like Barry Good Johnson's degrees. getting getting open every single play. Yeah, he's a dog, bro. There's a lot of dogs on the team, bro. A lot of dogs on the team, but, you know, I ain't gonna say no favorites. They all my favorites. They're all my sons. They're all my sons. They're all my Proud sons. Proud of each and every one of them, man. Proud father. Proud of all, man. And it's our first tourney, bro. This is the first time these guys have gotten together. Yesterday was a bit of a getting to know each other, a little rough patch. Like Zach said, we got to meet, One, we talked, two, aired everything out. Give it to him, y'all. Mm. Aired everything out. Short, now we're looking a lot better. We're looking a lot better. Hey, Tom, I'm seeing how much fun D is having, the fact that he has his own OT7 team. They're making a run. Uh, thoughts on making a, uh, a New York-based seven-on-seven team? Definitely not New York. And, 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 we, coach, not. and we coach it. I'm down to coach. The I wouldn't take Liberties. any kid from New York. <laughs> I'd take Mikey Eugenio with my first pick. Over and the middle. The rest oh, just uh, out of just the reach just missed of Tyshawn Dews. Just missed him. Yeah, Dave, we signed Mikey Eugenio, and the you can fill in the rest. 
Okay, perfect, perfect. <laughs> How about we buy Low Pro and rename them the New York Liberty? Well, I heard the D New never York paid him. I heard D never paid you Low Pro. You got me effed up, boy. <laughs> I paid them boys. I ain't gonna lie, it took me a while because his account was like messing up. I got to check his savings. He was asking for the routing number. I got to check his in the savings. You know how it oh, takes about three bands? business days. Five bands? Yeah, I gave him 5K. 16 9 Team Tampa. A touchdown here will tie the run. game. We got a little hocus pocus. Quick little run. Easy first down. We'll take that. We'll take that. New set of downs for Team Pressure. D, is it killing you seeing, uh, seeing AJ coaching on the field and, 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 and you got the headset on? Not at all. Not at all. Good. Not at all. That was the right answer. It's a team effort. That was the right answer. Somebody got to be there with the boys, man. I unfortunately couldn't. I, I got to pay my dues out here. Locked up, they won't let me go. Uh, but it's all good. I'm watching these boys, they doing their thing. Uh, <laughs> honored to be doing a game with Akon over here. <laughs> One. Big Merc two, drops Cayenne back. Cayenne Berry. Cayenne Berry. Told you. Cayenne Pepper Berry. When is, when is that celebration getting overdone? When, has it gotten overdone yet? Nope, nope, not yet. I, I saw D doing it before. Nope, I did see D doing it before. I just learned it, you know? I just learned it. You got to get hip with the kids and stuff. It man. took years of practice. Years and years of practice. D, oh, I'm going to talk to AJ real quick. You got anything you want to say to him, man? Yeah, tell him, you know, Take we, we hold it down. Tell him, hold it down, P.O.P. Say hi to D's business partner. Hold it down, P.O.P. Say hi to his business partner. Hold it down, P.O.P. First down. <laughs> Take another look right here. Cayenne I'm getting beat up in the booth. I can take it. It's fine. We need a pick right here. Ooh. And he need grip post. Two words, chat. Two words for him. Two words for him. Second down. In and out of the hands of three-star Kason. Stokes, take another look here. Nice ball. Oh, dang. Look at two. That boy Started the turnaround the a little bit early. My dog touched the ground back there. 16 all, still no money ball. We got a running clock until the one minute mark. And they're pick. taking a shot, Whoa, kind man. of. Lollipop? Duck too, we got a flag. He just tagged with him. AJ, we have a flag thinking? on the field, another we have flag. another nasty Offsetting, throw. offsetting. Two bad occurrences back to back. Why you got a wide open receiver, offsetting. and then you get an added flag on that. Offsetting. With a tied game, clock running down, that's not what he need. Now D Strong's up in the booth. He, he wants to know how's the vibe down here. It was going good. Hold it down, POP. But no, I mean, for the most part, they're staying together, bro. They're staying together. It's just right now, it's a close game. You can't afford mistakes like this. The refs is talking the whole time, and the clock's still going. You feel me? So, like, it's just this is when they start getting you. We going to win? We need it. Tell my daughter to hold it down, bro. All right, D said, hold it down, man. We need you out here, all right? POP. Hold it down. Uh, sir, my daughter, hold it down, man. Hey, we I'm were still pacing. I ain't sat down yet, y'all boys. D, we were talking earlier about you and AJ getting in the boxing ring. For the views, for the views. They said, everyone in the comments said you were two pieces. You you and Day got to be the undercard. That's done. Undercard? Done. Co co-main, co-main. Done. Co-main, yeah. Thank you, Tom. Thank you. <laughs> I thought it was going to be my business here, right but... there. Oh, Tom, man. Tom knows where the money is. We're, we we know that for co-main. Nah, it's me and Stupin. It's me and Stupin. I don't need that. That's weird. There's a run and down inside the 10, a new set of downs. You know, unpopular opinion in Tampa. Yeah, unpopular opinion. Talk to me. OT needs to change the rule that quarterbacks can make. What's wrong with I think it's weak. The quarterback's not accountable. for. And this is not teaching them any football. When are you going to run wide open in a football game ever? But you could also say on the other side that with two blitzes, it should somewhat counteract that because there's no, no linemen. All. Not at all. Because in two blitzes, you letting a man open. Nobody's there to guard the quarterback. You don't put him. It's if we I, had a random guy that could sit there, then I get it. I agree with you, but I think it's almost. It's oh, take a shot. Hell no. A little bounce. too high out of bounds. I ain't gonna lie, that boy got up there. Yeah, he did. <laughs> that boy got up there. I know it's out of bounds, <laughs> but we need to take another look at that. That boy got up there. Hey, hey, fellas. By the way, we got Cali Power. They're up nine to seven over Raw right now. So Raw is on the brink of being eliminated. Cali Power up nine to seven. Take another look right here. Oh my goodness. D, back to your point oh on, on the running. You have seven players to defend five players. One, two. Taking a two. shot. Oh, oh, almost oh, reeled in. We'll take that. Turn it on down. We'll take that. Third and we'll oh, bring up it was third, third down. A I huge, it was already third. A huge play in this game. Ooh, I'm just too anxious over here. I'm just anxious over here. 
This is a huge play in this game. This is essentially fourth down. Reminder, you only get three downs P.O.P. At OT7. Pull it down, y'all boys. Come on, fellas, get stopped. Baby, baby, baby. Take a look. Baby. One. Rolling out, here's the blitz. We have a pump fake. Clock's running out. Touchdown, Team Tampa. Offside. Offside on the defense. So he had offside prior to the snap. Prior, prior to the snap. snap. No, no, no. I believe the touchdown. No play. No touchdown. No play. Prior to the snap. No play. No play. Okay. Three feet down. Let's see what we got here cooking up. So if it's prior to the snap, we still got a blitz. If it's prior to the snap, we still got a blitz. Green play third down. Still third down. Offside. Look, 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 look at me. You, you see the rules back. on the screen. Yes. Five-yard penalty for the play of down. So it will remain third down. Right. Still a huge play in this game. We we'll move it up to inside the five-yard line. Now that was Malik Brown on the catch, number three. Let's see if they go back to him here. We have some, a little bit of confusion. I believe they are, Dad. We got number three on a little del what delay spot now. Out. What is AJ having his hand? Keep your oh, eye Jordan. on Malik Brown. He is in the slot at the bottom of your screen. One, two, play. Three. Fox running out. There Dad. he is. There you go, if you ask, you shall Dad. receive. You gotta go for the money. Yeah, I gotta ask him. We doing money? Gotta go for the money. Gotta go for the money. Malik Brown puts go Team Tampa up seven. Money job. Gotta go for the money. Nice throw. Money ball by Jacob Drackett, on, quarterback of Team Tampa. Come on, baby, we need this. My heart beating now. The Army commit puts Team Tampa up seven, and we have the money drive we need this. here for Team Pressure. It's all Meanwhile, going to corner fellas, plan right D, now. you want to explain the money drive? Right now. Money drive, if we score, we get 10 money points. That's all I need. Yep. That's it. Because we ain't throwing no picks. If we throw a pick, the defense gets six. We get turnover on downs, defense get four. But it don't even matter, because we get 10 right here. Most importantly, 10 points on the touchdown. Yep. Two and a half minutes remaining. Money ball, let's go. Let's go. Big Merck drops back, let's throws go. it over the middle, Zach complete. Zach Sample. Zach Sample brings them inside the 20 yard Zach line. Zach Sample. Clock management, boys. And pressure elite is off to a nice start on this drive. It looks like they can make a diamond out of it after all. Zach Sample recently committed to ASU. Now, he played for Heat 7-on-7 seven seven in some prior OT7 tournaments. Nice D huddle. said, D, D, D had some had legal him. legal tampering yep. and brought him over to I pressure elite. I gave him $10 million dollars to play for us. No, I'm playing. I'm playing. That's it? That's <laughs> it? Light work. Light work. Look at that clock management. Bleed that thing. Bleed that thing. Calm, cool, One, calm, cool and collective under two. pressure. Merck dropping back over the Easy. middle. Easy work. Easy work. We'll take that. That's four-star TJ Moore. We'll D, you have that. a four-star. Who just caught his first ball of the game? It's all good. We got a lot of power all over the team. This guy, a lot of this guy, TJ Moore, has 45 offers. Now he's him. He's a dog. <laughs> if we need a jump ball in the end zone, guess who we going to? <laughs> the man who has offers from Bama, UGA, it. LSU, he's Ohio him. State, Boomer he's Sooner. Him. Yeah. He's him. Yeah, not, not a bad choice. He's him. He had 24 yards per catch he's in him. high school. He's him. He's big. That's too. crazy. He's like six four. One, two. Looking over the middle, nearly oh, intercepted. We gotta catch that, baby. We gotta catch that, baby. That was back to TJ Moore. By the way, 6'3", 190. Big boy. Squeeze that in. Bring up Squeeze second down with one minute left. Now the clock does stop. That we are uh, in a minute. That's yeah, my team, but we gotta drop the two words. Man. That's my dog. TJ, you supposed to catch that, bro. It's accountability. It's accountability. You're supposed to catch that, bro. Yeah, I'm kind of nervous right now. Brings up a huge second a bit, down. We might need the dual box here because D is sweating Boy. like Shaq at the free throw line here. Easy. Merck over the middle. Let him touch. Ah! Yeah. Yeah. Pressure. Yeah. A lead. Pressure. Row, row, row your boat. Row, row, row your boat. Row, row, row your boat gently down the street. Hey. Ah. Zach. Free samples for the whole team. Puts pressure elite up three with 56 seconds left. And D. Defense, you, hold it down, you need boys. Defense and Coach OTB to hold it defense, down. Defense, right hold now. it down, boys. Hold it down, boys. Whew. 
Zach Sample always oh. finds his way open. 5'9", 160, oh. and he is shifty. He is Let's shifty. Y'all are in pre One, two. First play, there's the run. Now that's the second run. They do not have any runs left. The clock will continue to run. They're up to the line pretty quickly. Three-point game, 40 seconds. One, two. Dropping back, looking to take a shot. That's complete with some daylight. And he is touched inside the 15 yard line with a new set of downs. 25 seconds. They still have the timeout in the pocket. Come on, y'all boys. Hold it down, man. It's caught by three star Case and Stokes. Back to work right here on first down. Team Tampa looking over the middle. Touchdown! Team short. Tampa. short. Scoreboard says, hey, we still have 12 seconds left. Watch the clock. But I can hear his heartbeat next to me. My guy destroying has the shakes with 12 seconds left. Team Tampa moves what ahead for? What up is that? four. What are they doing? What are they doing in the middle? They're reviewing. Oh, that's lame. That's lame. The touchdown will stand. Eric Fletcher, the 2024 wideout and safety from Fort Myers, Florida, puts shoot. him ahead by four. We got to shoot right here. <laughs> and Pressure Elite needs a score we to go to the semis. You still have your timeout, D. We got a timeout. We got to take a shot. Right? You want to take a shot here, or are you going two plays? You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You got the sidelines. You got a timeout. 11 seconds can go a long way here. That's not the start you're looking for. We gotta catch it, man. Eight seconds left. Now are you taking a shot? D, I'm sorry, man. It's all good. We got time. Yeah. Hey, Tom. Got time. Tom, would you take a shot here or would you go two plays? Uh, I mean, I like the first play to try to get a quick you know, a little freaking chunk. Catch it. Uh, two words, three words, four, five. They got their five. timeout, Dave? They still got their timeout? Yep, they Ten still words. have their timeout. Right, then, I think you can run something short. You gotta get some yards. Hey, uh, Tom, do you mind telling them they have a timeout, bro? Yes, Please. I'll tell them. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, man. Man, you got interns. Tell Coach. Tell Coach D says you have a timeout. Merck dropping back. Throws it. Uh-oh. Trouble. Trouble is here. And that will do it for Pressure Elite's run at OT7 East. Team Tampa moving on. Fellas, we also had a very controversial ending with California Power as well winning the game. They're coming up to the booth. They're giving it to my guy who's scoring. And, and I don't know what to tell him. I don't know what to tell him. This it. This it. Good game. Good game. Good game. This ain't GLD, my boy. What's going on? Hey, this hey, you got to talk hey, to AJ for that. Talk about the win. Man, this shit was sweet. We knew it from the start. You feel hey, me? Like AJ mouth, Greener. What? Boy, what? Hey, 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 watch your hey, mouth. Hey, watch your mouth. Sweet. Anyone can get checked in the broadcast. <laughs> yeah. Hey, good game. TJ though. Moore. Yeah, to y'all. That shit. Hey. Yeah. Pick to end it off. Yeah, you going to see up, us in the bro. finals? Good job. You going to see us in the hold finals? Yeah, Y'all got to hold down now. Y'all got to hold it down. 33-26, Team Day. Tampa. Yo, what's up, Tom? Guys, California Power and Raw are in an absolute blood. Like, it they is crazy. No, no, they're good. No fights, no fights. But California Power just won the game mm. on a last second. I don't know what. It looks like Raw ran out of time with about a half second left. Mm -hmm. And, of course, Raw Miami Great will game, not though. complain. Great They'll California be very Power mature about it. On. Team Tampa knocks off. Young Destroying's Pressure Elite. This man is stewing Frick. over here. If you weren't sure if it meant a lot for him, just take my word for it. He's pacing around like a boxer in the corner. 33-26 is your final. Team Tampa, the two seed, moving on to the semis. Impressive run, impressive run for Pressure Elite. The future is bright. We DEFCON and Legends coming up next. Do not go anywhere. OT7 East from Orlando marches on.
for Tom, for D. I'm Overtime Day. Do not go anywhere. You know better than that. All right, Joey, you're running a button hook, all right? Tommy, back quarter fade. Billy, you're going to pump fake and then hit. Coach, you don't remember my name, do you? I got 12 touchdowns this year. That's a rookie mistake. You're going to hit Nick. Nick, that's who you're going to hit. Snickers, official chocolate of OT7. Overtime Tom here for a break in the action. A turnover can change the momentum of an entire game. If there's one weak link, the whole team suffers. So remember, vapes can contain toxic chemicals that can irreversibly damage your lungs and the team. Let's head back to the action.